All right, guys, I got this uh, Kawasaki mule here. It's a 620E. And I, I couldn't, for the people that owns it, they couldn't get it, they couldn't figure out what was wrong with it. Couldn't get it to start or anything. And I started messing with it. I couldn't get it to start or nothing. It wouldn't turn over. It wouldn't click. Nothing like that. And then I, I started checking fuses and everything. But and all the fuses were pretty much good. I found one blown fuse, but it still didn't fix my problem. But I, I tried a bunch of different things. Like I said, when you turn the key on, it wouldn't click, wouldn't uh, crank or nothing. The owner put a new battery on it, still didn't do anything. And I searched all over this thing. And then I finally found this, uh, there's a neutral safety switch down here, right there. Your uh, neutral safety switch, it's got a little wire that comes into it and it screws to this. And it, when it's in neutral, it's supposed to kind of ground it out, but it's a bad neutral safety switch, I'm pretty sure, because I pulled it out, and you can you can take it and uh, ground the bolt out or whatever, and it'll the mule will crank over, start right up. But what I did instead of buying a new switch, we, he may buy a new switch later on, but I just here's the wire right here. I just took the wire and. And grounded it to the motor i'm gonna do something diff different with this this little eyelet here i just got it bolted there for now well, it ain't really bolt it's kind of just pinched in between the rear end there and that bolt i'm gonna have to get a bigger eyelet there and uh crimp it to that wire right that little ground wire here and then i'll i'll get one big enough that'll i can slide that bolt through the hole that little eyelet there so and that way it won't fall off or anything like that. That right, that set up there, it'll probably eventually fall off or something, or it'd come off, vibrate off there. Maybe not. It's on there pretty tight, but I'm gonna fix it different than that. But that's just the, the fix for now. Like I said, when you would, uh, would turn the key on, it wouldn't do anything, wouldn't click, wouldn't start or nothing. But now, I mean, the only difference is that without that neutral safety switch, you can you can start it in high, low, reverse, whatever. But, runs good, it ain't that big of a deal. It's starting in higher low reverse because they've usually always got the e brake on, and obviously, you should know to not have your foot on the gas pedal whenever you're about to start it. But that was just a quick little video. Hopefully, that saved somebody some time because I spent forever trying to figure that out. But I finally got it. Thanks for watching.